Hello, my name is Kingsley Shete and um, I belong to a group called the West Cameroon Movement for Change. Uh, by its very name, it signifies that it's a group that believes in the restoration of West Cameroon, the state that was formed when Southern Cameroons became independent as West Cameroon on the 1st of October 1961. Um, that state which disappeared in 1972 when um, Amadou Aijo um, surreptitiously um, organized uh, a, a, a referendum that was not meant to be and um, violated the federal constitution and took over that state. And uh, I, today, I think that the problems in the English-speaking regions of Cameroon can best be resolved through a federation. And uh, uh, I believe in inclusivity, so I understand the grievances and I understand the views of um, the Amazonians and we as a movement, we've got people within West Cameroon who actually believe in outright independence. And that's why today my chairperson, um, Mike Taki, sent me here to represent the group. So as much as I don't stand for outright independence, I understand why they would feel the way they feel uh, with the, brut the, br the brutal killings that have been going on and um, with the Bia, the Bia regime's intransigence. And so for me, um, October 1st is a, a restoration day, but it is about restoring the state of West Cameroon. It is about restoring the two-state federation, and it is about respecting the results of the plebiscite of 1961, in which the people of Southern Cameroon overwhelmingly voted to join the Republic of Cameroon uh, in a two-state federation. So I think um, unless another plebiscite takes place or another referendum takes place where there is a popular vote, and it overturns that one, um, and one that it's, um, has legitimacy, uh, that vote still stands. And uh, so that is, for me, what October 1st means on the first instance. On the second part, um, October 1st for me represents a day of mourning. It is a day, not a day, there's nothing to celebrate on this day because I, over, over um, time, many um, English-speaking Cameroonians have lost their lives on this day. And uh, last year, um, October 1st, 2017, was the highlight of it. Um, many people were killed, and I think that is the moment that um, the, the, the battle line was drawn that has thrown my precious country into serious conflict. And uh, uh, we don't see the end of it yet. So it represents for me a day where I have some sober reflection and I ask why and why and why and how we can get out of this. And I believe that it is by working across ideological lines working with everyone, um, irrespective of what their, their end game is, understanding that the grievances are similar and that what we all crave for is freedom and a fair society. That is what I stand for, and thank you for listening to me.